Hi everyone, today we're gonna work on uh, preschool math. Salut mes amis, j'espère que vous allez bien. Bonjour les amis, nous sommes tous à Colandanga. Les lots de travail n'habitent pas la mathématique et à école primaire. Alors, nous allons bagarrer sur vos amis. Tuna, au titre de la langue, on ne sait pas répondre. So guys, um, the math is this math is not it's not really that complicated. Okay, so um, uh, if you take your time, you watch carefully, and then uh, you should be good. Okay, so I'm gonna try my best as I can to help you. Guys. Okay, so um yeah so so when I open the calculator we do together it's a simple math but when you're in school okay uh, the teachers sometimes you know they want to show they want you to show them your teacher want you to show her or him or them how did you get the answer though so if I open uh, bring this one. If I bring this right here and then we do seven one minus five eight, this is the answer you're gonna get. Eh? You're gonna get this. Eh? This is our answer. We're gonna get two oh four, right? This is what we got here, right? This is the answer, right? Now we follow this. We have to show our teacher how we get our answer, okay? That's the way you can do this, right? Now, we're gonna write here, okay? And we're gonna write two of them. Minus, okay? Write this. This minus is here, okay? And then we're gonna write right here. Now, you see seven one two. We're gonna write it right here. And okay, seven one two minus. We leave it, and we're gonna write this five zero eight. This is the one minus now you see this eight is eight you're gonna put it right here you're gonna write it right there and we're gonna write it also right here so if we read 712 minus 8 equal what you're gonna get here you're gonna get seven zero four right when you do the math both of them but that's what you're gonna get when you do five hundred and eight minus eight you're gonna get five hundred okay? this is the one you're gonna get five hundred okay? This is the one you're gonna. Now you see this minus. So what we're gonna do here? We're gonna put equal. We're gonna write this seven hundred four. Four minus minus in case uh, you don't see what six here. Huh? So four. This 704, this is the one. You may say, how I get uh, 704? This 12, uh, uh, 712, it's right here, minus this 8. That's why we have 704. Now, this is 704, we write it right here. Okay? Minus 500. Right there. 500. And then equal. You're going to say that where this 500 is coming from? This 500, it's right here, minus 8. This 8. So we, our answer is 704 minus 500 equal what? We're going to get 2, 0, 4. When we bring the calculator right here. This is the same answer we got. 
Eh? In case you don't get it, 712 minus this 508 equal. That's what we got. Okay? That's how we do it. Okay? That's how we do it. So, this is a way to show your teacher that you understand how to do the math. You may say, then how did you learn this? My friends, I learned this in school several years ago. I did well in math, okay? Now we're going to do the, I'm going to show you guys how to do the other one, okay? So now we're going to do this, okay? So if we do, we bring the calculator, we put 8, 1, minus 32 equal 49. This is the answer we got, 40. Nine and eh? forty nine, right? Now we ha we want to show our professor how we get this forty nine, and eh? we're gonna show your teacher how you get forty nine. This is how we're gonna do it, okay? Eh? Don't panic. So we're gonna is this this is what we're gonna do? We're gonna write this and eh? two of them. We put our minus, okay? we put this minus right here, and then we're going to write another one, and we put equal. Okay? So the first thing we're going to do here, we're going to write this in the one, minus, and we're going to write our 32, minus, okay? minus. Now, we're going to get this 2 right here, this 2. We're going to write that 2 right here. We're going to write that 2 right there. Now, when we do and 1 minus 2, what are we going to get? We're going to get 71. We're going to get 71. Because what happening? You take... Two inside of and one, it's left. I mean, um, sorry, uh, seventy nine. Sorry. When you take a two inside of and one, you're gonna left with seventy one. Okay. Now, when you do thirty two minus two equal thirty, right? Because you take two inside of thirty two, you left with thirty. Okay. So this is what you're gonna get, duty. Okay. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna do here seventy nine. We're gonna write it right here. This is seventy nine minus. This minus. So this is seventy one. Eighty one minus two equals seventy nine because you're taking two inside of eighty one and you're gonna left with seventy nine. We write here. Now, when you take 2 inside of 32, you're going to left with 2D. This 2D, we're going to write right here. Eh? And equal. Now, 39 minus 2D equal what? It means that you have to take 2D. You're going to take 2D inside of 39. What's going to left with you? You're going to left with what? 49. Right here, you're gonna left with 49. Okay? In case you don't get it, we bring the calculator right here. So you what do you do? And one. Uh uh and one minus 2d2 equal 49. Okay. So in case you don't get here, this is the one 79. Minus, eh? Minus thirty. You go nine. Eh? That's how we do it. Okay. Now we're gonna do the the next one. Okay. So now we're gonna do this. The same thing. When we open uh, our calculator here, we're gonna do six zero nine minus. Four zero seven oh. That's our answer. Two zero two. 
right? There's another way you can do this. You don't have to do it like that. There's another way you can do this. You can also do like this. Six, zero, nine, time, and we're gonna put four here, zero here, seven here, right? In this, okay? Now, seven, uh, minus uh, nine equal what? Equal two. Zero minus zero equal zero. Six, uh, four, uh, four minus six equal what? Is two, right? The answer is right there, right? You can do this this way too, but I want to show you guys another way of doing it. It's easy. Even the other one we do, there's an easy way you can do it. Really easy way. You don't, because I want to go with you guys step by step. Really, it's an easy way to do it. Really easy. Okay? So, what we're going to do here is, I'm going to show you guys another way of doing it. Okay? So, so we're just going to erase this. Show you guys a way of doing it. Okay? So, if we do, we write this, okay? We put like this, okay? Because the teacher, some of the teacher are picky. They want you to show them the way of doing it, okay? So there's another way of doing this stuff, okay? So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna write that, we write here, we put minus, we write here, we write here, and then we put equal, okay? Now, we're gonna rewrite this. Six, zero, nine, minus, and we write, Four zero seven minus right. We're gonna get this is seven. This one we're gonna put right here, okay. And we're gonna put also right there, okay. We put it right there, right there. Now, when we do six uh six hundred nine, okay, minus seven equal what? What you gonna get? We're gonna get what? We're gonna get six, zero, two, six hundred two, right? Because when you take seven inside of a six hundred nine, you're gonna left with six hundred and two. Now here, when you take seven, uh, you take seven hundred, you take seven inside of uh, four hundred seven, you're gonna left with four hundred, right? So what's gonna happen? Make sure you write this. Six hundred and two. We're gonna write it right here. Six hundred and two, right? Minus four hundred equal. Okay. So when you do that, what are you gonna left with? You're gonna left with with two hundred zero. And two. So if I bring the calculator, we do again. Okay, we're gonna do. We're gonna do six zero nine minus four zero seven equal same thing right there. Just another way to show your teacher. Okay. So yeah. So I'm gonna stop here for today. So thank you so much. You guys take care. Bye-bye.